Hello dear students, welcome in this online session of 8th standard English medium. Now the lesson which we started previously in my lecture, lecture number 1, video number 1. In that, I made you to understand who was Bipin Choudhury and why the lesson is named on the topic of the lesson number 4, Bipin Choudhury's Lapse Memory. Just because the Vipin Chaudhary is a character in the story that is described himself by the narrator that he is actually a person who is forgetting most of the things and he is re trying to recall that kind of thing and he is also making himself puzzled. When he is recalling that kind of thing, he is making himself puzzled and later on he is also thinking that what shall be done next here. So the story is continuing in this previous lecture. I made you to understand that a, a man who is entering without his permission in his life means a man who is also known as introducer is entering in his life and he is making himself to make all the messages to him and make him understand also that he went last on the trip of Rachi and he also went with the uh, with the basic information in Rachi and the man who met him he said all the detailed theory related to him where he was confused and he said that you know I have never been to Rachi and then after all the doubts and all the questions and all he was actually relating with his friend and his friend is actually cl clearing him that uh, yes we have uh, we had a trip to Rachi and you are not remembering that kind of thing. So now Bipin Choudhury is thinking that is my memory okay or I am losing my mind slowly 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 as like my brother I am losing my mind. So this chapter number 4 lecture number 2 will be depending on the same theory and today we are going to learn about the uh, today we are going to understand this story from the part of third and fourth remaining part of the story first and two other parts are actually explained by me in the previous lecture so let's start the story here now as you can see on the page number 64 <coughs> english textbook honeydew that after the lunch after the lunch time bipin babu was somehow he was realized that how couldn't he possibly carry on sitting at the desk and working also he was thinking that i can be doing some kinds of work but he was still thinking about that same memory of the Rachi. Now, he had never happened, like it kind of, this kinds of things was never happening that he was so serious now in his work and he has a reputation in his, with his colleagues and all with a tireless, uh, we can say, person who was actually a continuous worker. He was actually a worker who was working without any kind of tire, but today his head was in a well. Means today he was not confirmed to do the work here and it was like, he was a correct person but he was thinking about that kind of theories related to that man who said that he has already seen this person means the Bipin Choudhury and helped him also in the trip of Rachi. So back to home at 2.30, remember the date my dear students that is back to home at 2.30, Bipin Babu lay down on the bed tired full and gathered his wits together, all his thoughts together and is thinking that okay, whatever is happening in my life is not in my control and I'm losing my mind. So he knew that it was possible <clears throat> to lose one's memory through an injury also in the head but he didn't remember any kind of single intention related to the uh, memory loss also where someone else has remembering they have remembered about everything except a particular incident about this memory loss so Bipin Chaudhary is telling that okay, actually I have remembered all the all the kinds of things but I have not remembered that when I got hit in my heart in my head and how I'm trying I'm actually now losing my memory my memory what was wrong with me so he is thinking about that kind of thing so he always had wanted to go Rachi and to have gone there done the things also he was thinking that okay, how could I should not remember that kind of thing that is impossible something utterly is impossible and now he is again thinking at the 7.30 once again we can say at 7.30 now Bipin Chaudhary was again he was feeling anxious so he was anxiously feeling that now what shall I do so literally Bipin Babu called his servant his servant came and announced that Chunni Babu sir Chunni Babu says it's very important somebody has come to meet you okay announce Chunni Babu sir says it's very important Bipin Babu known also very famous for his work and all and now he was relating with one more kind of incident here now what is that let's check it out in this theory here so Bipin Babu knew what was happening and he also knew about Chunni had come there 
and he was about to clear some kinds of theories related to chunni lal so now he had been at his school with him means chunni babu was actually his, like a classmate so he had been having a rough time lately and had uh, been coming to him to see him about job also asking for the job and all so bipin babu knew it was not possible to do anything for this person and uh, in fact the old uh, friend is not about to get help from me so he told him so that but chunni kept joining him means he was actually kept turning up like a bad penny whenever he actually gave him job he was not working properly he was not doing any kind of good things related to that so it was a fail experiment related to chunni babu therefore bipin babu said a word that not only it was acceptable but we can say it was possible for him to see chunni now but now in the several weeks he will be meeting him so he's telling to his servant that sorry today i'll not meet that person i'll meet him in the upcoming sessions so but there we can say servant stopped out the room and it struck bipin babu that chunni might remember something about the 58 trip and there was no harm in asking him so he's thinking that hey servant wait 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 ruko ruko call him maybe i could be asking some kinds of theories related to chunni shayad usko pata ho that i have ever got some kinds of problem related to head injuries and all so maybe he could help me out here so at the time chunni babu actually was in the downstairs and he was actually about to leave from here so bipin babu hurried down at the stairs and into the living room he saw chunni was about to leave but seeing bipin babu appearing here he hurried round hopefully he just went back oh bipin he said hey chunni yes yes come 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 here listen chunni i wanted to ask you something mujhe kuch tumse puchna tha now what was he going to ask you have a good memory aapki yaadas bahut achhi hai okay yeah obviously mr bipin just throw your mind back and tell me thoda socho puche i did uh, did i go ranchi in 58 in the age of 58 i i went to ranchi remember have you remembered chuni said 58 it must have been 58 or it was 59 58 or 59 he said yeah whatever but have i been to there ranchi mai gaya hu you sure that i did i did go to ranchi chuni looking towards him his looking in the amazement not unmixed with the worry you mean you have doubts about that is asking you have gone at the all there did i go there do you remember clearly tell me chuni telling care you are having doubt upon that ki tum gaye nahi gaye yaar just tell me out main gaya nahi gaya just tell me out here now chuni sat down on sofa fixed bipin babu with a long uh, we can say heart uh, side by side he was just making to sit him here chuni said you can sit here and now they both were trying to discuss now heart stare at the said bipin that have you ever got any kind of medicines which is actually taking your mind he says asking that bipin you have taken some drugs or something he just asking who is asking chunni babu as far as i know you had a clean record where such things were in the life and you much told to other also with the old friendships and all i know that old friendship don't means much to you but really at least you had a good memory so you can't really men of the mistake and you can't mistake this kinds of thing you must must have remembered have you forgotten the trip to ranchi bipin babu had to turn away from the chunni's incredulous stare means he was just looking like this yaar tum bhul gaye how can you forget how can you forget this now do you remember that what what was the theory my last job why i lost the job why, what was, do you remember about my last job about the theory he said yeah of course i remember of course you worked in the travel agency yes 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 chunni you worked in you remember that and you don't remember that that i was actually who fixed your railway booking for the ranchi i was there only who booked your railway ticket for the ranchi and i was only person who went to the station to see you off to say bye bye main aapko chhodne aaya tha wahan pe remembered to see of one of the fan also of your he was meeting to a compartment was not working with me and somehow he was also like i got an electrician to here to fix it out here and it was like one of the fan was also not working in a row are yaar ha 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 i remember but not that much i have remembered so bipin babu in the sense of general thing we can say he was confused and later on chunni lal was actually confirmed that really bipin babu went to ranchi you don't look well you know lagta hai aapki tabiyat bigad rahi hai now bipin babu shies and shook his head moving his head and he said 
I don't know what is happening, my dear. I have been with this working too hard. He said, बहुत मुश्किल से मैं गुजर रहा हूँ. And there must be the reason. There should be a reason that why I am forgetting these kinds of things. Why I am forgetting these kinds of things. Must see a consulting specialist. I need to go and meet a psychiatrist. A person who is leading with the, like you can say, with the your nerves and also he is leading with your brain. So doubtless, hmm, no doubt, Bipin Babu's condition, which made Chunni Lal to leave without mentioning anything about his job, bina kisi baat kiya ge, Chunni Babu is going from here, and Paresh Chanda, you can remember that Paresh Chanda was a young physician of the pair of bright eyes and the sharp nose. Now he became thoughtful when he heard about Bipin Babu's symptoms, and he met him. Means one another person is introduced inside this lesson as the Chunni is leaving from here. Now this message is going towards a doctor also, and doctor is actually a very beautiful, like a handsome doctor is having a sharp nose, two bright eyes, Doctor Chanda. And now basically you must cure me of this horrible illness. Is telling that please cure me. I can't do how it is affecting my work to here. Now Doctor Chanda shook his head, thinking about that. You know what, Mister. Choudhary, he said, I have never had deal with this kinds of such cases like yours. But frankly, this is a new one and quite outside of my field. Uh, but I will have one suggestion to you. I will give you a suggestion. I have a suggestion. I don't know what it will work or not. Will it work or not? But it's a worth, and I can do no harm, or I can do this for you. It will do no harm to you. So. Let's try it out here. Actually, try करते हैं basically. Okay, so he's telling that कि यार actually this is not my field, but then also this is a new case, so I will try for that. मैं try जरूर करूँगा आपके केस के लिए. And I also think that positive that you will become uh, very good enough. You will actually save yourself by this kinds of case. So as far as I can make, said Dr. Chanda. And now I think you are of the same opinion. You must have been to Ranchi. आप गए हो Ranchi. मुझे लगता है. But due to some unknown reason, some reasons which are not known in the story inside the theory, you are not remembering that kind of that kind of theories. So this is a site of place. Maybe you remind your trip. Maybe you remind your birth. Maybe you remind your coffee at Ranchi. And I cannot do any kind of moment. He is telling that I can't remember nothing. I remember. Okay, okay. I am prescribing a nerve. Tonic. Now what is that? That is boosting up your nerve. I'm prescribing a nerve tonic, and uh, that you have to take it out here. So he's prescribing a nerve tonic, which is essential, and symptoms will be getting more pronounced slowly, slowly. Bipin Babu felt somehow getting uh, relief. Next morning, when he's waking, uh, wake uping from his bed after the breakfast, he rang up his office and gave some of the instructions to produce a first-class ticket for Ranchi for the same evening. And then he's going and he's saying, saying yeah, he is making his trip again to the Ranchi and is thinking that कि यार एक बार घूम के आते हैं। Now getting off train next morning he realized that at once he had never been there before. Now he is again thinking यार ऐसा कुछ हुआ ही नहीं मेरे साथ। And now he came out of the station, took a taxi and drove around to the town for a while. He just just making his round towards his own town. He realized that the streets, the buildings, the hotels, the bazaars and the uh, the hills also, which we can say the Murabadi hills. As he where he visited there would trap the Hudo Falls also. Is there any kind of Hudo uh, Hudo trap or not? Hudo Falls are there or not? So he actually went there, and now he didn't believe that. But something is happening with him, and he was thinking that okay, this theory which is actually happening with me is not related with the general fact. So the man who was named as Bipin Choudhury was now. Actually confused out in this theory, and when he is confused out, he didn't believe that. Okay, so, but what is the same time this is happening? He didn't wish to leave the feeling that he had actually tired enough, and so he arranged for a car and left for the Hirudo in the afternoon. So he went there at the fall also, and now he was actually thinking to. Set up his mind to see these kinds of beautiful places. So at five, at five, the same afternoon in the Hirudo, two Gujarati gentlemen met. Okay, from the group of uh, we can say like uh, picnickers, discovered Bipin Babu lying unconscious beside uh, beside the we can say boulders, means beside the roadside. So when he became actually round, the first thing Bipin Babu said, "I am finished. There is no hope left here." When they took this man. At the side of the picnickers, Rachi, he was unconscious. Unconscious means he is going, he is taking the trick, he is he is taking the train, he is going inside the train, and now he is taking a taxi, and then he is going to the Hero of Fall also at the tourism places, and the Rachi, and now he is actually faint becoming. Means he is without any kind of consciousness. 
और वहाँ पे पड़ा होता है देन पीपल कॉट टू गुजराती कॉट एंड उन्होंने उठाया एंड देन ही सेंग यार एवरीथिंग इज फिनिश सब खत्म हो गया मेरा नथिंग इज लेफ्ट नाउ नथिंग इज लेफ्ट नो होप इज देर नेक्स्ट मॉर्निंग बिपिन बाबू वॉज बैक इन Calcutta. Now he is going to Calcutta. So he realized that that there was truly no hope left for him, and so he would lose everything: his will, his work, his confidence, his ability, and his all the balance of mind too. So he was thinking that he is actually going mad, or he was actually losing his mind, same as his brother, who was also not working properly according to his theory of his brain, and he died later. So Bipin Babu couldn't do anything. Back to home, basically Bipin Babu was not thinking about this kind of thing. And now back to home, he rang up the bell of that same doctor. Remember when he's coming back, he's ringing up the bell of same doctor, Doctor Chanda. And now he asked him to overcome. Come over means what? To examine himself. Then after a shower, he got into the bed, and the ice bags were clamped on his head. to keep the head calm and he was all confused out just then servant brought him a letter which someone has left for him and also in that letter box a greenish envelope can be seen out here it was like a greenish envelope now that letter was gifted it was uh, named in the red color of the ink on it here now what was there about the name therefore something was written on that letter here urgent and confidential it was written like urgent and confidential now what was that in spite of his own condition bipin babu had a feeling that he ought to go through with the letter he needed to read that letter early morning when he is coming from this area back to home he is reading this kinds of letter he tore open the envelope and he out saw the letter there was what the written okay now what was there actually this is what he read in the story i am reading here you need to focus in the textbook here dear bipin the letter is there okay dear bipin I had no idea that is affecting to your brain. Affluencing would bring about the kind of the changes in you, but you actually it has done to you. Now, what is difficult to you is to help out an old friend, and also down on his luck here, luck. Also, I have no money, so my reasons are limited. What I have imagination, a part of which. i have actually used in the uh, in the rebuildation or you can say retribution of your own using feelings unfeeling behavior so i am observing you not feeling well well you'll be all right soon again now a novel i have actually written in the beginning of the considered by the publisher that if like it's enough to be published i'll see through the next few month will be published out also when dr chanda came there was unusual letter written here related to his friend when dr chanda came bipin babu said i am fine it all came back as soon as i i got off from here the train to rachi a unique case happened with me said dr chanda i shall certainly think about that write about the medical general about write about this kinds of theories what was happening with you the reason why i sent you actually now dr chanda is saying the reason why i sent you back to rachi because said bipin babu it's that i have actually pain in my hips and also from all the fell i had made in rachi so if you could prescribe a pain killer it will be better for me means now in this end of the story after reading the letter bipin choudhary is remembering his all the sense and is thinking that he is okay actually something was created by a friend to him and the doctor is also thinking that ha huh, everything is good with him that's why i made you to go rachi ha huh, now feeling better he said yeah 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 i remembered everything and actually i fall down there so there is a pain in my back side of the area uh, so please give me a medicine and i'll be all right here so my dear student this lesson is actually depending upon a funny character and a very good theory related to the bipin babu also and he's forgetting something and some of the people are also playing tricks upon him so the doctor is helping him whose name is mr chanda and i hope that you enjoyed the lesson i hope that this lesson gave you some kinds of theories ha but apart from the theories if you want to go really to rachi if you want to go really to calcutta and all you must go and visit that places it will be helping to you also it will making you good effect of the essence also to you take care we'll see you in the next part new fresh of a lecture till then you can keep revising keep learning jai hind